Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all doing well. We are currently on our way down to Cheltenham. Um, we are going to Cheltenham races tomorrow, which I'm super excited about because I've never been before. Um, so yeah, we're heading down now. We've got about three hours left. We've only just set off. We're staying at 131 tonight. Um, we have a, have a reservation at a restaurant called Yoko. I think it's Yoku, it's Japanese. Um, it's in the hotel when I've heard so many like really good things about it. So I'm looking forward to try that. Um, and then yeah, tomorrow racing. Fingers crossed on the weather, it's currently raining. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to try it. It's my first time at Cheltenham Races, so it should be fun. Mum's been really a really nice person and said that she'll drive. So currently, yeah, about three hours to go. Um, yeah, hope you all enjoy this video. We've just arrived in the gorgeous 131. Look at these gin and juice glasses. I love them. And even cuter. Look at this, <laughs> a mini Miraval, I love it. Um, Holland Cooper have actually left a little gift in the room, which I'm going to open now, in their beautiful packaging, which I think is for their 15 year anniversary. So I will open it, and I think, I think this is their fig scented candle I look really orange sorry excuse this lighting it's not the best it's like it's quite late so it's artificial light but this is the candle I think it is the fig fragrance which is lovely but just like how nice is the black and gold and the detailing is beautiful so that's very kind of them and a nice little surprise so I'm just going to get ready now, um, as I said we have a reservation, I think it's 7 or maybe 7.30 um, at the Japanese restaurant, so might just have a quick shower, like touch up my makeup a little bit, I feel like I'm a little bit sweaty, um, and then get changed and head for some food. Okay, so this is my outfit for tonight, this top is from Raban, I have already done an Instagram picture in this my uh, gold Holland Keeper bag. I've got some Zara trousers on. This blazer that I'm gonna put over my shoulders is from Amanda Up Richards, which I did in my last video uh, with the satin lapel. These shoes are Jimmy Choo. And that's about it, about to head to dinner. Just got back to the room, dinner was so nice. We had, I didn't vlog that much because it was quite like an intimate setting. Um, and we were kind of like right near like the entrance. So um, yeah, I got I filmed like a few bits on my phone. We got some like prawn tempura, um, some like wagyu, what else did we get? We got some like really nice like sushi rolls. Um, and some like chicken yakitori kind of thing um, and then we had the dessert was really nice it was like a coconut banana kind of thing of like toffee and ice cream sounds nice but I, like I feel like I need chocolate I have this like really bad thing that like I need something sweet after I eat and I know that I had a pudding and that was kind of sweet but I still feel like I need chocolate and there's loads of chocolate in the car but like I can't be bothered going to get it I've got something in my eye it keeps going really blurry um but yeah I think I'm gonna get like an early night because well we're up at well, we have to go to breakfast at nine um and then I think we're getting like picked up to go from breakfast to obviously the race course so I will be up relatively early um to get ready and whatever else just 
currently have Big Brother on, now watching a bit of Gogglebox. They have like outside is like a bit of a party going on, so it's quite loud. Um, so hopefully be able to get to sleep. But yeah, had a really nice night. The food was amazing. It was really, really beautiful. So it definitely lived up to the expectation. Um, but yeah, that's about it really. Going to get some sleep. It's, it's like 10 o'clock. <laughs> um, I, I go to bed so early, it's so bad. Like I'm in bed, like falling asleep at half 10 is like, I'm doing well. Um, but I'm up early, I guess. So anyway, uh, yeah, going to bed now. See you in the morning. Jem, look, Jem, we're racing today, look. Come on. Say hello to the camera. This is your vlog, not mine. Yeah, I know, and I've started it. But, so we're at the Chatham Festival. We're here today. We're in the uh, Holland Cooper Suite at the moment. The sun, immaculate weather today, Jem. Come in. You're on there with champagne. Are we drinking today? You are drinking. We're drinking some rosé. Whisper an angel with a little bit of lemonade. Here we are. We're having a lovely afternoon. Hi guys, <laughs> we are currently on our way back. I am absolutely aware that this vlog has been crap. <laughs> um, it is, yeah, it's not been my finest performance. I've not really vlogged that much when I was there. The bits that I did do were on my phone. I didn't really vlog that much last night. I just feel like this let you guys down with this one. <laughs> Um, but as you can tell, we're on our way home. I'm driving because mum's had a drink. Got two hours, ten minutes to go, stuck in traffic. So that's a bit annoying. It's half five. Um, so don't think we'll get home till about just before eight, probably. Want to stop at the services because... Well, I'm, I, I'm not really that hungry, but you know when you're just driving and you're bored and you've got nothing else to do? Probably more that. And it'll be, be too late by the time we get home to start making dinner and all of that shit. Um, you're swearing a lot. I know, yeah, I didn't mean to do that. Um, sorry, Mom. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, that's about it. It was I'm, a good day. Huh? It was a good day. It was. It was a really good day, actually. There was some really lovely people in the box um 
met some new people which were really nice caught up with a few old friends um the racing was good the weather actually like was really good um so for my first day at Cheltenham first time at Cheltenham it was really good um would definitely go back again next year um so yeah that's about it really i think they they are having like a an after party back at the hotel um that i was invited to but probably would have meant me staying down again another night which um obviously need to get back for the horses and and things like that so yeah on our way back home now was planning on trying to ride when I get home but if I get home just before eight I'm not sure if it's I'm gonna be able to um, but yeah we'll see we'll see if we hit any more traffic um, but yeah just thought I'd check in with you guys <laughs> I might need to add something to I know this, yeah what can I add to this vlog hello I am currently on my way to the spa um, this is a few days after um, Cheltenham I got home at Cheltenham we got stuck caught in quite a bit of traffic then when we got home I literally just went to bed um, so yeah didn't vlog the last few days to be honest I've just had a few days of like trying to sort out a few things like we're going to Dubai Maldives in well just under a week so I'm just doing a was doing a bit of online shopping trying to sort everything outfit planning you know just back to normal life horses riding etc um so yes anyway i'm on the way to the spa this morning um it's a spa quite local to to where we are um actually right next door to the racing our racing stables so just going for a morning at the spa um just fancy it um so yeah i thought i'd bring you along with me to that it's such a beautiful spa um it's really nice it's part of a hotel it's called carden park um so yeah i thought i'd bring you along because why not pod things which are quite nice it's absolutely freezing outside I've just got in the pool and then I decided to come outside just to I don't know different change of scenery and it's freezing um, but I've got some brunch thing there was like a few options of like um, eggs and scrambled eggs avocado pancakes and then like eggs royale eggs benedict so I'm gonna go for some brunch i hate the word brunch um i'm gonna go for some brunch in about an hour um at half 11 but i feel like half 11 is it's just a bit of a weird time i've like i've not had breakfast 
but then half eleven's not really breakfast it's kind of like lunch then it'll get to like three o'clock four o'clock and then i'll be hungry but then won't want to eat because then i'll have dinner you know it's one of them times it's just a bit like annoying um but anyway when i come to like the spa it makes me think like why don't i do this more often <laughs> like i know it sounds stupid but in terms of like self-care i actually don't do that much like i'm desperate for my hair to be cut and i've probably left it too late now because i'm going away in like well a few days um i leave on tuesday and it's now friday um so yeah i've probably left it too late which is fine because when i curl it then it's not that long but it's literally touching my bum um but yeah i should come to the spa and do things like this more often like i never get facials i never get you know like any treatments or anything like that which i should do because like just a morning at the spa is just so relaxing and worth doing so i'm gonna make an effort to do more things like this i'm having a bit of an issue with i'm going to dubai i haven't already said and maldives but in dubai i'm going to dubai for like three or four days and whilst i'm in dubai i'm going to the dubai world cup which is horse racing for those of you that don't know and i went i think i went last year and it was a really really good day so i'm really excited to go but i'm having a bit of like i don't know what i'm going to do with my dress i've ordered i've ordered three dresses two of them are, have arrived so i've ordered one which i think is like my favorite at the moment it's sort of like a camel caramel color um it's like right to the floor um and it's kind of got like it's got like capey drapey <laughs> i don't know how to describe it like sleeves like the sleeves are like um how would you say it like it the sleeves are capey but like only on this side like this side is just nothing if that makes sense so like my whole arm is out but the like but it's yeah okay maybe i just need to insert a video but it, anyway but my point was it's quite similar to the dress that i wore last time in dubai and i'm obviously just conscious of like the racing and stuff like that like i want my shoulders to be covered like i want my arms really to be covered i want it to be like quite long and, and stuff like that so and i also want it quite like figure hugging because you know i, I don't think i really suit like or i'm quite picky when it comes to like floaty dresses i don't think it really suits me that much um but yeah the dress that i've bought which is my favorite at the moment i feel like it's really similar to the one that i wore last year the one that i wore last year was like a deep green which was really nice um but yeah the other one's like a camel caramel kind of color um but i feel like it's just really similar i might insert like a picture now off like the website so you can see what i mean um but then i've got another one which is like navy it's like lace but it's obviously got like a under thing it's not just pure lace um and that's really nice too but i feel like i love it but i'm just not sure it does as much for me as the other dress and i feel like i'm not sure if it's a little bit i don't know i think it's quite like a a more how do i say this I, i'm not sure if it's like a more of a like a older person's dress <laughs> like i'll also insert a picture for, that you can see but it's yeah i'm not sure i'm not fully convinced on this one but i ordered another one anyway a white one which is not come that i need to try on um that i'm leaving two minutes like to the last minute because i've had to drop the camel one off at the tailors to get that taken up a little bit but by the time the white one comes i probably won't have time to do any alterations to it but it's like a three quarter like midi length anyway so it should be fine um
guys, I think I'm going to end this vlog here. I've just got back from the spa. I had a really, really lovely morning, feeling very refreshed. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to carry on with the rest of my Friday, going to go and ride Ronnie um, in a bit. But yeah, my next vlog is going to be my Dubai Maldives vlog, which I'm super excited about, really like buzzing to vlog this. Um, might do two separate videos. But anyway, next time... I upload it will be my Dubai one so hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one